Hello, hello, hello. This is a signing at a signing table. I am with my client, AKA my lovely dog. We are going to walk through of how to set up your signing table. Of course, you need your documents. Have two of them. I print out two. One for me to sign with the client and the other one for the client is signing. That's if the 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 signing company say don't make a copy to them. Two, of course, you need your notary stamp. You need your, pen, your thumbprint. You need your pen, and you need your notary uh, book, law book. For at the end, you can get her the stamp, get her thumbs, and then you sign up the information. This is a scenario on how to do a V and A settlement loan for a property husband wife some type of thing like that or a vna a veteran loan on a mortgage document however which one but this one is a vna mortgage documents because she's a veteran we would pretend my my client's a veteran so she's doing a veteran refinance mortgage document that's how we're going to put that that was a lot of work. Yes, but since I have her ID already, took a picture of that. Of course, you need up front the ID and all her documents. So I need her 2019 taxes. I need the ID, need a copy of the Social Security, and I need a bank statement from the last three months. I received all of that, took a picture of that. My first document, I have my stuff flagged out already. So I'm gonna go over. Since I am not a lawyer or attorney, I can just tell you what you were signing and as you look over it. I do not go into details. So let's get into it. Hello, ma'am. My name is Tataya. I am your signing agent, your long signing agent, okay? Yes. So we're right about now. Since you already know we are doing it today, this is a notification of your borrow. I just need you to sign your name, <clears throat> date it, and can you make sure when you sign your name, it match the rest of the document. This is your first one. So when you sign, all your signature got to match all the document. So I understand we, by the time we get to the fifth one, our hand premiership changes, understandable. But make sure the premiership stays the same, okay? So we're just going to sign it, and we're just going to date it. And that's it. Why am my client signing that one? I'm already having my next one already together. So when she done with that one, I have the next one signed. Okay. Flip that one over. She's signing the next one right off the bat. So I can keep it as a flow. My minimum to stay in her presence is more than 10 minutes. 10 minutes is pops, possible. I'm sorry. We're going to sign your name there. This, we're going to sign your name exactly how that is, and we're just going to date it. Oh, so this is going to just print my name. Just write it back. It just, nope, we're going to sign. You'll curse your name. Oh, you're going to sign it. Yeah, we're going to sign your name. Can you put today's date on all documents if it just says name? Just put the name. If it's the same name and date, put your name and date. The next one, this is where your credit card for the direct deposit and everything else. So I just need you to sign that. The next one is an eternity. I just need you to sign that right there. And I also need you to date it. The next two is the acknowledgement, the sign your name, and date it. And the next one, you're going to be doing the same. Sign it, and that's the date. Mm -hmm. Why is my client signing that paper? I'm getting started to find the next one. 
You can flag your documents if it's comfortable for you, where you don't have to be so nervous and get all the documents. But five out of 10, keep them in order for it to be better. So when you send them off, that everything is in order when they send it to you. The next one is the attachment form. Just sign your name and we don't need to date. Just sign your name. <coughs> Thank you. We're just gonna sign your name again and we're gonna date it. I see why people don't feel like they're doing things. Jesus, this is a lot of signing. Yes, it is. My hand print been changed like four times, I'm pretty sure. Mm. Yeah, I'll say why. The next one, <laughs> we're gonna sign and we're gonna date it right there. We almost done. Almost done. Almost done. Almost done. The next one, we're just going to sign our name there. This one, this is about your credit. It just whatever you just did with the documents with your lawyer your uh, lender they just gonna pull your credit that's all but I just need you to sign it and date it the next one is the acknowledgement can you just sign it and date it and make sure all your documents of your signature is stayed the same. Thank you. Just that's all. Thank you. Are you upset because you keep thank you because you keep handing me papers and I'm not understanding <laughs> what this is? But you know, got love your mom. Helpful, very helpful. Mm. I'm trying to make sure uh, this is the day. Just sign your name and we're going to date it. And we got like two more documents to sign and we are done. This feels like more documents and you got to sign on the birth certificate. Yes. We're just going to sign our name. And then the last document I re signing, we're not really signing. I just need you to look over to, to make sure. If everything is correct. I bet this took hours to print. Just look over to make sure everything is, if your name is correct, your address is correct, and the date, state, you already signed it, so I'm just wanna make sure that everything is correct. This correct. Since I have my documents already in order, all I have to do is pick it up, and put it in a folder. That's it. My clients already have a copy and I am about to send them off. And I go over while I'm here in front of the client and any notary stamp, I stamp it. But since it's a veteran loan, veteran loans don't get stamps. Veteran mortgage documents don't get a notary stamp. It just gets your signature, the dates, your name. So until then, she signed my book already. Got my fingerprint. I get her a gift card, a little gift, little baskets, a gift bag, whatever. She have my business pen.
She had my business card, appreciate her my service, and that is it. Talk to y'all later.